Not many people have had the chance to look under a train. But if you'd like to find out what's there, just ask an engineer. Some trains, like the automated people movers in airports and the monorails, have side skirts, which hide what is at the bottom of the train. Yet, there's a lot to see. One of the most important and safety critical components of the train is found at the bottom of the trains, the bogey. What is a bogey? A bogey is one of the main components of the train vehicle. The bogey is essential to the motion of the train. It supports the car body in which the passengers travel. A bogey comprises a frame structure made to support the wheel sets. So axles, bearings, wheels, traction motors, the gearboxes, the brakes, current collectors, and suspensions. The car body sits atop of the bogies. There are typically two bogies per car, but some train configurations include Jacob bogies linking two car bodies. When a bogey includes a motor, it is called a motor bogey. Else, it is called a trailer bogey, as it is pushed and pulled by either a locomotive or a motor bogey. The bogey comprises two layers of suspension. Primary suspension between the wheel set and the frame, and the second layer of suspension is closer to the interface between the bogey and the car body. These layers of suspension absorb the shocks and impacts of the track to improve ride quality. Some bogies have anti-roll bars, which limit the roll motion of the car body when entering in curves, helping with train stability and passenger comfort. Likewise, some bogies include steering mechanisms and tilting mechanisms to help the bogie take tight curves to ensure passengers remain safe and comfortable. So, as you can see, there's a lot going on at the bottom of trains. Visit our channel for more answers and to submit your own questions. The most interesting ones will be showcased in future episodes and you may be selected to be the one presenting your explanation when people ask an engineer. Thank you.